Hey guys, what is up and welcome to a new uh, League of Legends-ish kind of video. Uh, we're on PPE, we're playing Team Fight. Oh, is that uh, Gimme? We're playing Team Fight Tactics, of course, the new game mode. Uh, yeah, this is literally my first time playing it. Uh, I game just started out of nowhere and here I am. So let's get this party started. If you guys enjoyed, don't forget to hit that like button. Let's go, let's, let's play. How's this gonna work? I mean, I played a lot of auto chess. I played my fair amount of auto chess. Can't say I played this one at all, so. If you guys aren't aware the way this usually works, can I move this chat? This chat's like not in a spot I want it to be at. We'll put it up here, I guess. Oh, oh, this is that jumping in the back. Okay, I can't even move the camera. That's kind of weird. I don't like that I can't move the camera. Why can't I move the camera? Maybe. Oh, what did I get? A giant spell, 200 HP. Okay, so we have a Zed level one, right? So because of that, Zed right now, I believe his class. Why can't I click on him? I believe Zed is a ninja and an assassin. Yes. Yeah, so if I have one ninja exactly, that ninja actually does 40 or gains 40% extra AD. Um, okay, so what are we going to go for, boys and girls? We have a Noble Ranger. So we have Ninja and Assassin. None of these, in my options right now, are Ninja and Assassins. I have two golds. So I can get two of these. Usually what you want to do is you want to get at least two of them. Um, I want to go for Vayne for Noble and Ranger. And I'll try Mordekaiser maybe as well. Let me think. Let me think. Uh, Wild Brawler is pretty good. Actually, I want to go Void and Sorcerer. I kind of want to try Void. I think Void could be really cool. So let's try this now. Hold on a second. Okay. All right. So now this is still minion round, right? You can see up here, there's usually three minion rounds or like NPC rounds at first. And then it goes into um, like facing other people. I don't know why. Okay. So you can't even. Ah, interesting. So you can't move your mouse. So you can click on them to see other people's boards and stuff, but that's about it. Okay. So Vayne, what, how do I? Okay. Here we go. So Noble is 100 armor if I have three of them. And okay. And then Ranger to attack. Okay. So let's see, Blade Master and Noble. So I can have a bunch of Nobles here. So I might go for Double Fiora and Assassin. Perfect, perfect. Now is Cossack? Is, is he? He's a Void. Ooh, how many Voids do I need? I need three Voids. Okay, so I want to put in Cossacks actually, right here. Put Zed and Cossacks in the back, and we'll put Cassidy in the front to tank. Once we get a second Fiora, or rather a third Fiora, we can upgrade them. Let me go ahead and increase the sound. Okay, put her here. Okay, so if you right click, you can actually click on them like this and see what, exactly what they do, all their information. So Noble, again, I need three of them, right? I only have two right now, technically, back here. My Cassidy, right click. Oh, plus 20% spell damage and 200 health. So I might give that to Cassidy because he is kind of my like tank right now, let's say. So the comp I'm trying to go for is going to be Assassin plus Void. Now, the reason I'm doing that is because Assassins do extra damage if you have more of them. Uh, hold on, let me focus on this. Okay, this is perfect. That's exactly what I need. Another Imperial, actually. Actually, no, wait, I don't have Imperials. I got Imperial and Noble mixed up there. So we have a Demon Ranger. That's pretty good. Uh, I might try that, actually. Let's try Varus over here. Correct. Demons is a chance to have uh, to burn all enemies' mana and deal that much true damage. Yordle Gunslinger. I don't think I have any Gunslingers at all. That's a Ranger, not a Gunslinger. Knights are pretty good, so I want to buy a Knight as well. Again, it's not a bad idea to try and buy often because you can always... Oh, we're teleporting somewhere. Okay, I think we're... Oh, someone, someone's coming to me. Oh, he has Garen, Lucian, and Tristana. Okay, so he's going for, like, Gunslingers. Yeah, he has two Gunslingers, but I think you need three of them. No, you only need two. Wait, this guy's murking me. Wait, this guy's actually destroying my anus. <laughs> Wait, what the hell, dude? This guy's, this guy's OP! Wait, this Garen's so tanky. Oh, he has a two-star Garen. No wonder. Okay, he's, he has a two-star already. This guy's smurfing on the block. What the hell? I would like some two-stars, too, please. Okay, so what are we at right now? So, I lost to him, unfortunately. Okay, it's fine, though. Ooh, Kha'Zix, nice. Do I get the Kha'Zix there? Uh, I guess we'll get the vein here. I'm, I'm so close to upgrading. I, I don't really want the Varus. I actually don't think I want Varus. How do I sell? Sell for two gold. Yes, I don't really want Varus, actually. Uh, I probably will take the Nidalee for now, though. I feel like I need... Do I have any more Imperials? I have two Nobles. That's all I have, though. I mean, that guy did have... Okay, so now we're fighting this guy. What the fuck? This guy's level 4? Wait, he has a level 2 Mordekaiser and he's level 4. Jesus Christ. This guy's OP as hell. Okay, I lose this guy too. Okay, so we're on an inting strat right now. It's actually a strat. Like, believe it or not, in, in Dota Auto Chess, there's actually a strat to int. Like, straight up. Uh, essentially, what it means is, assuming this works like Auto Chess, which I'm assuming it does. I don't really know. Maybe I'm over here. Yeah, you can see it says win and loss streak, right? So there's literally a losing strat where... If you lose early, it's actually not a bad idea to start losing a lot in a row, but not too much, obviously, at the same time. Uh, literally for the sole purpose of... 
Oh, there we go. Level two casted in. There we go. And we can add a level f another unit in here. So we can add. We have a pirate gunslinger. We don't really care about pirate gunslinger. Yordle and sorcerer. Wild and shape trips. I guess I'll buy the Nidalee and I'll buy ninja. Thing is, I don't know if I want ninja only because I already have Zed. Hmm. Uh, I guess I'll put him in. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa! That was bad. That could have been bad, actually. Okay. Wait, did I? Did I keep the Shen? I did keep the Shen. Okay, that's good. Because I think Shen's a Blade Master. Yeah, he is a Blade Master. I have I have two Blade Masters as well, so I need one more Blade Master to get that passive going as well. Now, this is a 4v4. Dude, my Darius is getting absolutely destroyed. What's casting his ability? I steal mana and convert into a shield. Okay. Kill the Vayne. Kill the Vayne. If we kill Vayne here, we win. Okay. Why is this red buff? Attack steal 2.5% burn damage. Jesus. This guy's OP. He has no mana to steal, though. I'm actually a little bit worried. Do I win this? Oh my god, that red buff. I actually might lose from the red buff, straight up. No, I got it. Okay, we killed him. See, I'm actually not sure if that was a good idea to win that round, only because I lose my loose streak bonus. Okay. How do you decide who goes first? Oh, I need the pike. I need the pike. Wait, what? I need the pike or cannon. I can't go yet? Why? I need pike or cannon. Can I please go? I just gotta take my cannon. I need the pike. Yeah, give me that pike, baby. Give me that pike. Again, I'm trying to go for assassins, right? Pike has an assassin. He's an assassin, and he has apparently he comes with a large rod, unused large rod. Apparently, that's pretty nice. So I guess every like three, four rounds or something like that, you get these like random kind of RNG rounds almost, where the people that are the furthest behind start first, and people that are like the highest or doing the best go last, and you get to just essentially pick a more or less a free unit. Now I can get a Z over here, which is. Pretty ideal. Um, so let's see, let's see. How do you want to do this? I'm probably gonna end up putting in this guy here and taking out. I'm actually gonna just straight up Solidaris. I don't really want the Darius. So I'm gonna put the Pike back here. So now we have, see, boom, we have triple assassins, right? So now they deal 150% crit damage, which is pretty good. Uh, I'm gonna buy a Z here, and I'm gonna buy Kha'Zix. Beautiful. And I'm gonna buy Cassidy. So the way it also works is, by the way, if you guys don't... Wait, was I able to have five units? What level am I? No, I'm level four. This guy's level five. Wait, oh, this is the first place guy. He's smirking on the block right now, apparently. Um, So the way it works is... I'm actually not doing that bad, to be honest. I'm pretty sure I lose those still. Unless Zed actually smirks on the block here. No, he's not smirking on the block. I need my... Okay. Okay. Wait a minute. Okay. Okay, the assassin bonus coming in. Okay. So we have we have three assassins plus the one ninja, right? So 40% attack damage on the Zed, and plus all my assassins are also doing 150% uh, extra damage. This guy had an extra unit, and I still beat him, which is pretty insane. What's going on up here? Oh, they're fighting the Mordekaiser versus the Lulu and the Vayne. Oh, the Lulu ultimate on the Vayne as well. Yikers, boys. Oh, departure. If you don't win fast enough, you actually lose. So, uh, okay, anyways. What do we have here? We can get Fiora and a Vayne upgrade, which is not bad. We'll get them for now, right? So we have a two-star Fiora and a two-star Vayne. Now, what level am I? I'm, I can buy four experience for four gold. I'm level 16. No point in doing that right now. If you win a round, yeah, okay. So you want to try getting to 20 gold in this case. I don't think I have a way to get to 20 gold unless I sell the Shen or I sell double Nidalee, which will give me to 18. I can sell, if I win this round, I can sell double Nidalee and Shen because uh, I don't think I need them. Then again, it is, how many Blade Masters do I need total? You need that many Blade Masters. I think I'm going to go for Assassin Comp though. So I'm not sure if I actually, like my goal is to try and go for a Void Assassin Comp. You can see the assassins, look at them just like critting and stuff left and right. So Zed throws a shuriken, dealing 200 damage. Pike, what does Pike do? He uses his E ability, dashes further and creates uh, a stun plus the damage. Okay, so it's the E ability. Kha'Zix is Q ability. So it actually does have the isolation part too, okay. I'm actually heart smurfing on these fools. I need to give this, I think, to Kassadin. Kassadin is like my tank, he's like my front line right now. Um, I have to give it to him. I ended up winning. I What's the hockey? Is there a hockey to sell? Like, how do I sell? I want to sell faster. How do I? Is there a way to sell? Ooh, the Zed, though. And the cast it in. I'll take both of those. Is there no way to sell faster? Like, is there a hockey to sell faster? Let me check. Interface. Hockeys. Okay, here we go. Team fight tactics. Uh, sell champion E. Okay, so it's also E. Same thing as auto chest. So I might actually go ahead and sell the Shen. I don't think I, I... Actually, no. Eh, yeah, I think that's fine. It's not a bad idea, actually. Okay, so we have four out of four units. Uh, we can buy experience here, but there's no point because... Okay, so this is an NPC round. 
there's a very high chance that I actually win this round because it's NPCs, right? So if I buy experience here to go up to level um, 5, I would have dropped below 20 gold. And if it's the same as auto chess, you don't get gold for winning an NPC round. I mean, we'll find out. I don't think you do. But like one gold um, for winning a, like the round. Wait, do I actually win this? Okay, I do win this. Thank God. I do, right? Wait. Oh, holy shit. The Pike... I thought Pike died when he used his E for a second because all I saw was like a weird shadow. So I'm like, wait, he's dead. Wait, do you see... Please. Please, 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 please. Oh, thank God. Okay. Wait, you don't even get one gold, apparently. But yeah, the reason I don't buy is because if I am if I fall under 20 gold, then at the end of this round, my income is going to be less because I'm under 20 gold. So now I can actually buy the experience and we can level up. So we can put another unit on the field. Uh, I want to probably put the Fiora, I think. I think I'll, be, I'll put it on Fiora. Yeah, I'll put it on Fiora. Oops, that's, what the hell? Where am I? Okay. I'll do this right here. Boom. Beautiful. Okay. 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 So now, what do we want to buy? Uh, I don't really want any of these guys. Uh, actually, I want to buy uh, Brom. I think Brom is good. And the reason I'm buying Brom here is because he is... Um, I picked him up by accident. Okay. The reason I'm buying Brom is because Brom uh, is a guardian. There's two guardians. Him and Leona. Right? So if I get two guardians, that's actually really good with Assassin as well. So what you want to do is you want to... Because you can sell most units for the same gold that you spend buying them. So what you want to do is... You want to buy like extra units sometimes, even though if you, you, you might not use them, because you can always sell them after, right? But you want to buy them just in case you might use them, because if you will, you know, you have more options as opposed to just kind of going only one path and just crossing your fingers for the RNG. In this case, I'm kind of splitting into two paths, and then as I'm going, I can pick whichever path I'm kind of getting better luck with. So in this case, right, I have Assassins, which is my main one, but I also have Boyd, which is the Cassidy's second trait, and I have uh, now, in this case, Braum, which is uh, Guardian, right? So now, if I find a Leona and, you know, more Brahms and stuff like that, then we're good to go. Um, if I don't, then I try to go for Boyd instead. That's kind of... Okay, see, there we go. We found some nice stuff here. Beautiful. So I'll take all that. Nice. So I'm actually getting pretty close to a three-star Cassidy, which is going to be very, very good. How do I... I want to press... How do I... Hmm, there's no way to do it. Okay, that's fine. Uh, okay, so let's start giving items. I don't know why I'm not doing this. I should be giving items to my units. Okay, so let's give... How do I... How, how the fuck does this work? I'm so confused. Wait, how, do I just do this? Oh, okay. You just literally drag and drop. Okay. I thought I had to, like, pick them up. Because in auto chess, you have to pick up the item yourself with the, with the courier and then give it to your unit. Wait, this guy has a goddamn GA. Hello? Oh, he's also... This guy actually plays auto chess, I think. Oh, he's last place, maybe he doesn't, I don't know. He's actually stacking his units in the top left. He's trying to run the hunter comp from auto chess from Dota. It's not working out for him, though. Alright, so, let's see. What do we have? We have two voids. We need one more void. Uh, yeah, we need one more void, and I need at least one more... Uh, I need Leona, essentially. And then I can get double this. And the reason I, get, I want Guardian is because you can see only two Guardians at the start of the combat. All uh, the Guardians... All the units adjacent to the Guardian. Um... Hmm. Assassin. I mean, I see assassin. I take assassin. Uh, okay, so uh, I can either I can let me see. What is this? What does he do? Gengar leaps to the weakest enemy, getting attack speed and critical strike. But this is a stun. I think I like the pike ability a bit more. Okay, so uh, how do you see what items build into what? Because I know the items here are a lot different. Let me see. I have a, a cheat sheet over here. That, thank you, Mr. Scarra, for it. Um, I might end up settling Nidalee here. I don't think I actually need Nidalee at all. Like, I don't think I'll be ever using her. So I actually might sell her. I can upgrade her here, but I don't really think I need to. I just don't think I'll ever need to use her. She's a wild shapeshifter. I don't really need either of those. You know what I mean? Um, okay, so what does Rod of or uh, Large Rod upgrade into? So let's see, let's see. I need to see Large Rod. So two ro Large Rods actually upgrade to give you 50% extra AP, which is pretty good. Uh, Giant's Belt. What kind of Giant's Belt upgrade into? Giant's Belt plus Rod of Ages gives you a Morale Nomicon. That's pretty good, actually. That's pretty fucking good. Maybe I can give it to the Cassidy and give him the Morellos. I'm, I'm, I'm pretty close to level 3 Cassidy, so at this point, I, I feel like I should stack Cassidy. You know what I mean? Okay, let's see. What do we need? We have a Kali, we have Kennen. We need a Kali, and we need Kennen. Uh, there's no Cassidy. Cassidy is like my number one pick. Actually, no. You know what I want? I want Pike. I get level 2 Pike if I get Pike here. So I think I'm going to go for Pike. Unless someone takes it. Okay, no one's taking Pike. So I'm gonna go for Pike because I just want a two-star Pike. Because I need, I just need one more. I have one in the field. I have one in the bench. If I get one more, it's a two-star. But having said that, I also kind of want a Kali. And the reason for that is because I think she's much higher of a tier. Let me check quickly. A Kali in Assassins. Uh, wow, she's actually really, really good. I'm gonna take a Kali. 
Never mind. Akali is like really high rated in uh, assassins, and she comes with the recurve bow, which is not bad. So I'm gonna take that instead. Okay, beautiful. Okay, so now as you can see I have too many units, so we're gonna do is we're gonna sell that and put that on the field instead. Beautiful. Now we have the assassin passive uh, thingy activating again. So Akali it does her Q. I think what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna do. Actually, no, I want to buy the pipe. I have a two star pipe now. Never mind. We're chilling, boys. We're chilling. Get the Cassidy, of course. Yeah, We're stacking Cassidy. Um, no point in buying experience. Rare 50 gold. Now, I'm not sure this is like auto chest, but usually the interest, you can see it says max 5. Okay, so it does say max 5. The interest caps at 50 gold plus, which is in this case max 5, right? For every incremental of 10, you get that one interest. So at 10 to 19 gold, you get one interest. 20 to 29, you get two interest, etc. 50 plus, five interest per round, which is big. So you want to stack those if possible. Um, so in this case, my goal, because I'm doing really well, because I'm winning, I'm not too scared of losing at all. So what I care about is uh, essentially trying to keep this interest above 50 gold as much as possible. So I never want to drop this below 50 gold at the moment, and unless I'm, I mean, at least I don't think I want to, uh, unless I'm like really desperate for something for whatever reason. Now there's a high chance I'm going to be selling this vein as well, because at this point. I don't think I'll be going for that. Glacial and Knight, that is actually pretty good. I don't really need the Fiora anymore. So what I can do actually, uh, I can actually take away the Fiora and I can put a Kali in here instead like this and have these guys be chilling because a Kali is supposed to be pretty strong. I'm going to buy the Sejuani because she's apparently a high ranked unit. Uh, so I have, wait, is she not an assassin? She's, oh, I have four assassins. Okay, so I need three more assassins. So Rengar is my other assassin. I need essentially one more assassin. Like. Unique assassin, if you will. Um, so I don't really care about the Fiora anymore, even though she is level two, a two star. But I'm pr probably gonna sell this vein. I think I'm gonna sell the vein here. I don't think I need the vein at all. Yeah, you can see I'm winning the rounds pretty convincingly. Ah, this one's actually pretty close. Who am I facing? Grounds below you. He's right under me. He actually beat me. How did he beat me? What does he have? What he has. Is it because he's just too tanky? Maybe I'm not really sure. Hmm. Maybe maybe the maybe I should keep the level two Fiora in there for now instead of the Akali until she's level two because even with the Akali on the field, assassins assassins deal us. Uh, I don't know. It's hard to say. Maybe I'll actually keep the Fiora on the field for now. Just for now. Let's try this instead. So we will get the Pike here. Ooh, the Volley Bear. I can get triple Glacial here, but I I don't really have a way to put them on the field yet. So. Uh, what I'm going to do is I'm going to buy double experience, and I'm going to actually put another level 2 cast in on the field for now. Uh, actually, then again, he's not on a... S Let's put the Sejuani on the field, actually. Let's do it like this. So, usually, if, again, also, assuming this works like auto chess, um... Assuming this works like auto chess, your units gain mana whenever they attack and or, and or are attacked. Ooh, it's here, the goddess. What does that build into? All right, here the goddess. What is that building? So we have another large rod. Okay, I have another large rod. Beautiful. Okay, so I want to give one of the large rods to Pike. That upgrades to a death cap. So now he's really strong. Uh, Negatron cloak on my boy Zed, which I can upgrade. Oh, that's pretty good. I'm gonna give this to Zed. Now he gets this item, which is pretty cool. Whenever an enemy casts a spell, they conjure damage. Nice. Um, okay, so I don't. Ooh, a Brom. Definitely take the Brom. I'm not getting Leona though. That's kind of what I'm looking for right now. I'm looking for a Leona. Uh, so we still have only three assassins. Again, I have two assassins on the field that I can put up at any time, right? Being a Kali and Rengar. I just don't have them level two yet. So I'm, I'm waiting to get them level two. I'm also kind of crossing my fingers that I'll be getting a casted in. Now, I actually kind of made a mistake there. I should have refreshed. And I, I need to start refreshing because I'm actually kind of wasting gold here. I'm not being efficient with my gold at all. Um, there's just too many things to pay attention to because I'm not used to the game yet, honestly. But. Look at my Zed Goat, baby. Look at the Zed Goat. Never mind, he's getting shot. Okay, yikes. Who am I facing? Don Hop. He's a last place guy, but he's beating me. And the reason he's beating me, I believe, is because he has a good comp against me. Uh, he's going a lot of, like, tanky champions. Uh, and assassins aren't good against that, usually. Until I get more of them or some shit, so. If I can get another Void, maybe, that'll be really nice. I need three Voids. I'm not getting Voids. Another. There's a Cassidy. Ooh. Or rather, a Kha'Zix. I'm really getting what I need, so I'm gonna refresh. Oh, wait, I should have... Eh. Hard to say, actually. I do have a level 2 Cossacks. I, I don't think I'll be getting... Oh, uh, Katarina. That's pretty nice. That Katarina's looking pretty nice. So what I'm going to do is... Actually, I'm going to probably sell this guy here. Get the Katarina for now. 
Other Katarina. Ooh, there's a Draven too. Okay, hold on. This is getting confusing. One second. How do we do this? 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 I need to level up. That's what I need to do. I'm actually going to buy a lot of experience here. I'm going to lock this. I, I made mistakes. I'm not I'm not being efficient with my goal. Again, it is a new game. I'm still learning. Like, even though I played a lot of auto chess, you know, there's still a lot of things to pay attention to that I'm not used to yet. So I leveled up so I can put another unit on the field. Essentially, what I'm trying to do here is I'm trying to free a space so I can start getting these bad boys here. There's a lot of units I need on this page, right? Especially having the two Cossacks. So I'm very sad I sold that Cossacks now. That was just a little bit unlucky, honestly. Uh, okay, so what we need here is... Uh, I guess we'll put out this guy for now. Yeah, we'll do that for now. We'll take Katarina. And I can't really take this Kha'Zix, so that's the sad part. I, I I just don't know how to take him. I, I don't think I can. Like, how, how would I take him? I I, I need my Kassadins. I'm so close to Kassadin. I need my Brahms. And I need the Rengar and the Akali because I need to upgrade them eventually. So I can't really do anything about them. So we'll just I'll leave it as is for now, I guess. I should win against this guy, I think. Actually, I don't know. He's actually doing a lot of damage. What the hell? What's his comp? I know. How do I check his comp? Like, it, I wish there was a way to like click on them and find out exactly what they're doing. This guy's really strong, though. Is that a three star? I think that Graves is a three star. He looks pretty big. It could be a three star Graves. Damn, that's pretty lucky. Okay, what I'm gonna do instead then is I'm gonna sell. I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna sell those two. I have a higher chance to get out of three star Kha'Zix than I do the other guys, so I might as well sell those bad boys and go for this instead. Ooh, another one of these, okay. I need the Akali. I need the Akali. The Karthus is really, really good. He's a super good unit, and the Yasuo is OP as fuck. Who's taking the Yasuo? This guy's taking the Yasuo. No, okay, so I actually think Inting Strat, where you grief, is actually really good on this game now. Because you get first first dibs on this shit. It's really good. First dibs on this is really good. Now, what I might do is I might just spam rerolls until I get a Kali. I, I literally need another Kali ASAP and upgrade her to level 2. That's going to be a pretty big power spike for me. Okay, we got a Zed there, but I don't need Zed anymore. Um, okay, so let's see. Where is my Kali? She's right there. What the hell is going on? Okay, so we don't need any of those. Ooh, Cho'Gath is looking pretty spicy, though. Uh, okay, so we're gonna sell the rank up for now, actually. And I wanna buy... The Ch I want the Cho'Gath. Why can't I buy Cho'Gath? What? What? Okay, I guess no Cho'Gath for me. That's unlucky. Um... Wait, really? Yeah, I can't put units on the field temporarily? Like, in auto chess? Really? That's kind of unfortunate. Okay, whatever. Time to buy experience, I guess. That Kindred ult, though. Come on, Kha'Zix, kill. It's looking winnable. Is that? Is that? Is that? Oh, baby! Okay! Kill him, baby! Kill him! Nice! Good. Okay, I don't like how you can't put units on the field. I actually don't like that. I need. I really need this Shogath. Never mind. I might get that Shogath, apparently. That Shogath would have been really good here, actually. I'm not gonna lie. A little unfortunate there. Uh, okay, so I guess you can't do that. It's unfortunate. Let's start refreshing. We got another Cho'Gath, which is good. We got another Kassadin, which is also good. Okay, so you know what I'm going to do? I'm actually going to sell both of these. I want to get Kha'Zix. Upgrade him. Get this guy and get this guy. I'm going to put him back and put the Cho'Gath on here. Now we have three voids, which is perfect. So all allies ignore 50% armor, which is perfect. Uh, and then we're going to reroll and pray we get something. We got a Sejuani, actually. Hmm. I don't really need the Sejuani. She doesn't really give me anything. Right now, I just kind of have her on the field just because she's a good unit. Solo, I think. The Void is going to be really good. That one guy that I lose to sometimes... Actually, I think it's this guy right here, maybe. I'm not sure. He's still really strong, but what the hell? It was a lot closer, though. I go through a lot of their resistances now, which is pretty good, though. Okay, it's fine. I'm going to buy experience. I really need units, man. Oh my god, that's pretty lucky. Holy. That's so good. Let's put her there. I, I might as well just take her back at this point. I don't think I need her. Let's put a Kha'Zix in. We got a Kale. I don't need Kale, unfortunately. It's a Noble Knight. I don't think I need that. Right? I don't really... I mean, I get two Knights. What does Knight do? Yeah, I don't really need a Knight. So let's refresh. Actually, I want to level up. 
I think I'm gonna level up with it. So I can put in another Kassadin. I'm just trying to stack my like good units right now, my like my, my strong units, I guess you can say. I don't need this VR. I'm probably gonna sell her really soon. I'm gonna buy the Zed as well. Okay, another large raw. Large raw plus a tier of the goddess. What does that combine into? On spell hit, deal splash damage. That's pretty good actually. Who should I give that to? I'm not really sure. Uh, okay, we'll get the Cossacks, of course, getting really close to him. Got the Leona, which is actually really good. But I ended up forsaking the uh, the Guardian stuff, so we're not going for Leona, unfortunately. Uh, okay, so we're going to give this to... What does his ability do? It's pretty good. You know what? Let's just give it to Cho'Gath. Eh. Eh, whatever. We'll give it to our boy Cho'Gath. Get him, get, get him that juicy Ludens Echo. Alright, so we have... Three assassins on the field. I need to get this Akali and Katarina on the field ASAP. Plus one more assassin. I sold my Rengar earlier. Maybe that was a mistake though. They can see I'm doing a lot better. Yeah, I'm doing a lot better now. So the Void plus... Yeah, the Void plus... Uh, wait, how do... I need to get a Yomus. Yomus is supposed to be really good in this game. Because it converts someone to an assassin, which is actually super good. So it's a spatula plus a BF sword. So I need to save for a spatula and BF sword, and that can actually convert somebody to an assassin class, which is really good for me. Yeah. Katarina, nice, finally. Okay, bring back one of these Cassidans. Rengar, beautiful. So how many assassins do we have? We have four assassins on the field. So I can remove the Sejuani for five assassins, but there's no point. So what I need to do right now, my goal is to level up. Um, to level 9. Because at level 9, that means I can have 6 assassins. Because 3 void plus 6 assassins is my comp right now, right? Obviously in the 1 ninja, but that's a total of 9 units. I'm level 8. You can only have as many units in the field as your current level. So I need level 9 uh, in order to, you know, do my thing. Which is, of course, um, have my full comp, which is 6 assassins. Because once I get 6 assassins, they deal 350% critical strike damage as opposed to only 150%. It's a massive... All of them too, right? It's a lot of damage. And especially with Void, giving me 50% armor penetration, that's like pretty big. So I need to get to that like ASAP. Um, so I need to like level up ASAP. Because um, I have all my assassins ready. It's a matter of actually putting them on the field at this point. So I'm kind of prioritizing levels at this point, I think. Let's do one reroll. Didn't really get anything we need, so we'll, we'll chill the 50 gold for now. We're not really too close to dying yet. We're at, what, I'm assuming that says 20 HP. I'm assuming that's my HP, right? We're at 28, which is not bad, so we can probably chill on that for now. Um, what does Katarina do for her ability? Death Lotus, oh, so it is the ultimate. Nice. Okay. What's Strogat's HP? 1980. Oh, he's so much tankier. Let's do this. Oh god, his units are over here. What the fuck? What does this stage mean? Oh, it's the random stuff. Okay. Oh, his Yasuo died fast. That's good. Wow, this Mordekaiser are super stacked. He needs to die. Nice. Oh, the Pikey, baby! The Pikey on the Lucian! Okay, coming in there, stunning his ass. Zed and Katarina, AFK, report him, please. What is that? Huh? Zed? Katarina? They're just AFK? They're literally just AFK. They're fucking, they're chilling. All right, how many left of us? There's actually not much of us left at all. Mm, I don't know what I want here. I'll be honest. I don't really want any of them. Don't really want any of them. Um, I guess I'll take the ring guard. The Swain's looking pretty good, but I don't need Swain. I'll take the Draven. I heard Draven's pretty bad. So I want to take the Rengar in hopes that I get another Rengar soon so I can just upgrade. None of these are Rengar, obviously. So let's go ahead and sell this Fiora. I'll take the Zed. Never mind. I guess we're not taking the Zed. Uh, okay. It's fine. Riot Games. Let's refresh it, I guess. Uh, don't need any of those. Let's refresh it. Got the Akali. Very nice. Beautiful. I don't want him there. I'd rather have the Kha'Zix there. He's level 2. Uh, okay, let's put a point. One more refresh. Didn't get anything I need from... Oh, we got the Pike, but I don't know if I need the Pike here. I'll be honest. And the reason I say that is because I just don't think I'll ever get a level 3 Pike. I'm just way too far from it. So I'd rather put a point into level up, I think. Uh, 
Yeah, this guy's pretty tough, man. I need to get my shit upgraded. What level is this guy? Ground's below you. What level is he? Level 8. So he's also level 8. Okay, so he's not that far. This guy's actually really strong. Okay, I need to start just spending my gold or else I'm just gonna lose. So let's just start spending. Katarina. I think I'm gonna go all in here. We're going all in, boys. This is it. Nice. Okay, now we have... Take her back. Put the Kali in as well. Okay. Level 9. We're all in at this point. I need one more Rengar. But I'm not getting one more Rengar. None of these are Rengar. Okay, whatever. It's fine. How do I check how much gold someone else has? Though? That's my question. How do I know how much gold like everyone else has? How do I, how do I check that? I don't know. Alright. Ooh, that Shogath. Ay, nice Shogath too. Yeah, I don't know how much damage I'm doing now. See, like, the second they, that's it, they just crit and everyone dies. Like, the, the thing with this comp is that it's really, 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 really aggressive, right? It's super, super aggressive. Six assassins, three voids. It's literally just all in. I have, I don't tank anything. I have no tanks. But I also do a shit ton of damage. Like, an absolute shit ton of damage. I don't want any of these. I mean, I'll take the Katarina, I guess. It helps for a level 3 Katarina eventually. I literally need one more Kassadin. Nice, there's the Rengar. Beautiful. We'll keep it at 10 gold for now. So now we have a level 2 Rengar as well. We have no items to give, unfortunately, which kind of sucks, but... We are chilling. One... Wait, I have... Actually, wait. I need to test something after this. Hold on a second. I'm confused about something. The Chokath skew seems really good, actually. Okay, so I, I... Is it six unique assassins or six assassins? I mean, like, I mean if, I, if I take this Kha'Zix off... Okay, it doesn't matter. One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, we're chilling. I'm stupid. Yikes. All right, we got another Rengar. I guess we'll take him. Ooh, the Brando. One reroll, only one. That's it. That's all I can afford. I don't want to drop a low ten of gold. We're not getting the unit we need. We need literally one Cassidin for a level three Cassidin. That's all I need. One Cassidin, and that's it. I'm not getting it. I'm not. I'm not getting it. Sajwani is a knight. So two knights, two glacials. Don't need that though. Level nine is the max level in this game, so I'm most likely just gonna straight up sell the Sajwani here. I really don't need her. I don't think I'll ever use her ever, actually. Yeah, it's just every time you hear that ping, 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 ping sound, it's me critting. And yeah, these guys are just getting shit on at this point. I'm I'm full comp, like I'm 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 literally full comp. But I don't know what comps anyone else has. Like I can't click on them unless I'm missing something. Maybe you can. Maybe press tab. No, tab doesn't do anything. I want to see what other people are running. Like I want to see their comps, but it's not letting me do that, which kind of sucks. But it's unfortunate. Uh, okay, so we're gonna just keep refreshing. We're essentially looking for just more assassins and a Kassadin and a Cho'Gath and a Kha'Zix. Pretty much anything I have on the field right now, I'm looking for any of these units right now. Literally any of them. Uh, so let's do one more reroll, and we got Misfortune. That's pretty cool. Legendary unit. Five gold, which is a lot, but it's a powered gunslinger. We're not looking for powered gunslingers. We don't need that. This guy's actually pretty strong. That Brandolph is pretty annoying, but... I'm just, like, really strong. At this point. Like, I, again, I finished my comp. This is the comp I was going for. I finished it, essentially. So, yeah, I'm really, really strong. I'm just not getting what I need in terms of, like, really, truly finishing it all. I mean, I'll take the Akali here, which is good. Uh, she has a... Ra Wait, she has a Rapid Fire Cannon? Whereas cannot... Whereas attack cannot be dodged, and attack range is doubled. That's pretty cool, actually. Um, okay, so we'll do one reroll. Then get any... Oh, yeah, the Cho'Gath, actually. Do I want the Cho'Gath? I think I'm going to sell... Essentially, at this point, what I want to do is I want to sell a unit that I'm definitely not going to be finishing for level 3, right? Uh, based on how it's looking, it's looking like it's either the Zed or the Rengar that I'm not going to be getting for sure. So I'm probably going to sell one of those on the bench. Probably the Rengar. Yeah, I'm going to sell the Rengar. Buy the Cho'Gath. I guess. 
It's over, bro. It's over. This game's over. It's my win. Oh, what do I want here? I don't want any of these units. Ah, I guess I'll take the pike. I don't really want any of them, though. They're all pretty bad for me. Oh, wait. What am I doing? This cast in. Perfect. Thank you very much. Got a three-star cast in. What is he taking? The Karthus. That's a, I mean, a five-star unit or like a five-gold unit. So it's, it's a very good unit. But I don't really need that unit because... Ooh, Evelyn. Because, yeah, I have a three-star cast in now. Which is not working. What? What's going on? Riot Games. What the fuck? I, it's not upgrading. What do you mean? Upgrade. I have three of them. Riot Games. What the fuck? So what happens? Do I have 10 units on the field? Do I, I do I have 10 units on the field? <gasps> oh my wait a minute. What's going on? What just happened? Am I getting trolled? There we go. Thank you. Thank you, Riot Games. Nice. It's good. It's good. Six assassins still, which is good. Put the Kha'Zix there, of course. Uh, don't need the Evelyn. We don't care about Evelyn. Let's just start re-rolling. Start looking for units. Nice. Another Kali. Another Kali. Only the worthy will survive. I don't need any of those. <sighs> I'm literally not allowed to lose him anymore. So let's see what happens. I got a three-star cast now, so I'm hoping that means something. He's actually, like, stronger. Somehow. I don't know what he did. Wow, he actually wins, GG. Wow, he actually wins. I don't know what he did. GG. I don't know what he did. He changed something. I don't know what he changed, but yeah, apparently it was enough to win. But yeah, either way, guys, there you have it. Some gameplay of TFT. Let me know what you think about it below. I'll be making more videos as well. And uh, yeah, thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed it, of course, hit that like button. If you want to see like more videos about builds and strategies, yeah, let me know. But either way, guys, thank you for watching. And hopefully, I'll see you for the next one. Peace.